John, it segues quite nicely to semiconductors. I think I said this yesterday in the closed door, but I'll say it again. Um, I remember listening to you. Um, it was January of 2023. The National Security Advisor was sitting next to then Jake Sullivan. They launched ISET in the chambers. Semiconductors were a big piece of the ISET piece. Um, and you were very enthusiastic about what ISET could do for semiconductors. Are you still enthusiastic of what ISET did for semiconductors? Um, 100%. I'd just like to say thanks for being here. And I learned something new every time I come to India. I just learned the word prepone, which is, uh, anyway, it's, it, it, is, it is great to be here. Um, so uh, India has, has done a lot right when it comes to, to our sector. 20% uh, of our workforce is here. You have a, you have a, a for design of our chips. You have a great uh, ecosystem for that. Um, I, I think we're at, uh, uh, in, a, in, a, in a very special moment right now. We have this distrust initiative in front of us, but we also have a bilateral trade agreement in front of us. And I think those are two potential vectors for change that can really make a difference as India moves from not just design, but also into the manufacture side of things. India has made some great progress so far. Two years ago, there was really nothing in play. Now there's six important projects in play for manufacturing, including the the, uh, the uh, assembly test packaging facility being built by Micron out in uh, 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 Gujarat. Uh, so so I, I think there's been some great progress made so far. As India thinks about the next step in this area, um, I, I think there, there's many, many links on our supply chain that should be uh, turned to. One of them is continuing on the assembly test packaging piece of this. Someday India is going to have a $10 billion, $20 billion fab. Sorry, John, if I could ask you to put the mic up. Yeah. Someday India is going to have a $10, $20 billion logic fab, but not yet. That's a great aspiration. It's got to work up to that, take small bites of the apple. Um, the other piece that's not talked enough about is India should look at uh, PCBs, printed circuit boards. That's an important part of our supply chain. And then finally, um, um, critical minerals. Uh, there is one country that does a ton of processing of those critical minerals. And um, in this regard, and I think just generally, there is, we are in an era where diversification of our supply chains is going to accelerate. So I think that's opportunity for a lot of players around the world, but in particular, uh, India. The our market right and market size right now is about $600 billion a year in sales because of AI, um, automotive, many other sectors demanding our chips. We're probably going to be a trillion dollar sector by 2030. So the pie is getting bigger overall. And if India plays its cards right, its piece of pie will, will become even bigger.